sense is one thing that is not made in these forests. <laughs> Federix Pokemon Omega Ruby Pearlock, part 24. Hello buddy and welcome back to the Pokemon Omega Ruby Pearlock. <laughs> so, last episode, I got two pairs in one video. Growlithe and Vulpix, and Spinarak and Lady Burr. So, I was racking my brain, thinking which ones I could possibly use. And um, I decided on, for, for tight coverage more than anything, that I'd actually choose Spinarak and Lady Burr. I know that Growlithe and Vulpix are amazing, right? That is facts, but they're two pure fire types. And with Ladybird and Spinarak, you know, I get, I get Bug and I get Flying, which is awesome. That being said, during the training, something horrible just happened. Um, I just lost. <laughs> I lost Ladybird to this Lanoon. That happens. So, I've kind of got no choice now. I've got to use Growlithe and Vulpix. Oh, shucks. But that the reason why I chose later, but like I said, like I said, it's type coverage. Both Growlithe and Vulpix are uh, weak to what's it called? Weak to ground as well. So that I mean, only Bon out of my entire team would be weak. Would be um wouldn't be weak to ground. So you know, there's, anyway, I'll figure that out. I still can't. I, when we're ever going with this, yeah, Growlithe and Vulpix are awesome Pokemon in the day. So. Yeah, I was fighting this rich guy, and Ladybird, oh my god, I mean, I, I, I got told that Ladybird was terrible, but I didn't quite fully believe it, but yeah, Ladybird and uh, Ledian just suck, it lo they lost to that Lunoon out, what level was that Lunoon, 28, 29, and my Le Ledian was like 28 or something, like at any even match, easy to be able to do it, I got a critical hit and died, any who's all, I'm going to quickly head to the PC, and uh, sort this nonsense out, so we'll be back in a sec. Alright, let's head to the PC and sort this nonsense out, shall we? Alright, so uh, basically, um, I couldn't show you me physically getting the Pokemon out of the uh, Pokemon bank because I did it at work because my Wi Fi at home doesn't work. I have to connect physically. Long story. Anyway, so what are we doing? First things first, as you can see, Piss is still alive. PR55. That shouldn't happen. Release that. That died ages ago. Uh, vinegar also dead as a doornail. Bye bye. What else? Who else is on the bloody chop? Uh, we've got obviously here we go. This was creepy. My Ledian, who I was actually looking forward to. I, I, I like the idea of Ledian. It's just terrible. That's the problem really. So bye bye creepy and of course its partner Crawly, which was another poison type. Yay. Bye bye. Nice knowing you. I was, you know, I was, I was okay with them. Now let's just go through the pairs that I've actually got in my bank, shall we? So I've got Zest and T, my um, two clam pearls. I don't have the item needed to evolve them just yet. So, but they are water types, and I've got Bon Jovi. So you know, yeah. I've got Suck Rock and Looney Tune. Um, may get used at some point. It's my only psychics. And I've got here they are, Doggy. And style. Doggy, style, doggy, style. Oh my god, I'm so awesome. <laughs> so let's bring those into the team, shall we? And just for sake, we got Bonnie and Clyde as backup. So yeah, let's head out into the open world, shall we? Alrighty, Rue, boys and girls. Now, here's how. Now, you may be thinking to yourself, didn't the, the previous episode end with you talking to Steven? Technically speaking, yes. However, that didn't happen. That wasn't saved. Um, so basically, I'm going to talk to him now. But do I fight this guy? Oh, no. This guy gives me the good rod. Yay. I can catch stuff, except I can't. Because no catching Pokemon cause Pearlox. So, here's how this is going to work. I'm not... <laughs> basically, I spent ages actually... Um, what's it called? Leveling up uh, my Ledi Ledian and... Spinarak, Eridos, whatever, and also the rest of my team by default, you know, just by proxy, you might say. But here's the deal um, to do that again with Doggy and Style uh, would basically make my actual team about, well, ridiculously overpowered. <laughs> so that's not going to happen. And ouch, that hurts. Oh, Carvana's bloody rough skin always annoys me. And yeah, Screech, avoid. just avoid all the stuff, that's brilliant, Bon. You're a good, good Pokescriff. 
Alrighty, so Carmine goes down, and I've just realised I should actually be using my actual team, but oh well. And there we go, Bong gets 33. So basically, my entire team's actually quite high level now. I think everybody's at 33, and Gyarados. Um, right, normally, well, I'd switch over to like W style and then switch on over, but Gyarados scares me, so I'm just gonna go straight over to Eddie. Alrighty, so Eddie is in. And I really, really am looking forward to using Arcanine and Ninetales. I've got two Fire Stones. I picked up one, um, I think it was from the Fiery Path. I can't fully remember. I'm pretty certain it was the Fiery Path. Uh, I got another one when I did Super Training to get the Moonstone for my Nidorans ages ago off screen. So I've already got two uh, Fire Stones, which is great. Problem is. Um, I can well I can evolve them whenever I want, but they don't loot. They don't learn moves when they evolve, which is probably the worst thing ever. Which is really dumb. I've never understood that. Oh well. Um, so yeah, we've got to go speak to Steven, but I'm just going to switch up the team one sec before I do. All right, Steven, what have you got for me today, my friend? Here he is, the man with the snazzy hair, the snazzy suit, and just pure snazz. <laughs> That's right. How are you today? So basically what he's going to do is going to just say, you're awesome, Pokemon are awesome, would you like a legendary? <laughs> that is the gist. But uh, to get said legendary, you've got to go on a little bit of a spiel, a little bit of a chat about stuff and things. And uh, I think we're about to see the legendary. It's a Hmm. Ooh, oh, there he is. It is a Latias, I think. Oh god, I'm going to get destroyed if I'm wrong. But I'm fairly certain. That's I'm 60% sure that's a laddie ass. Yeah, boom. Got it first try. Do you want to soar somewhere with you? Ah, yes. So basically we get to fly on the back of a laddie ass. That is pretty cool. That is, I'm not going to lie, that's pretty damn cool. Uh, but we don't fully control it just yet, but we will do. Oh, check this out. Look at this go. Oh. But the thing is though, just looking out into this area... IGN was right. Hoenn has too much water. <laughs> I'm sorry. I agree with IGN. I know it sounds crazy, but Hoenn seriously has too much bloody water. It's everywhere. It's like, it's like the plague. <laughs> it's just plagued by water. Oh dear. Anyway, after um, he's finished with his spiel, with his little uh, chatting. I mean, if anyone else was just nattering like this, I'd get annoyed, but because it's Steven, I'm fine with that. Oh, uh, the mem de se to carve the truth. Okay. Sense is one thing that is not made in these forests. <laughs> no sense is being made. <laughs> anyway, let's go into the nonsensical forests, and there it is. Oh, this is it. This, of course, we soared on Ladias to find the Ladios. Ah, uh, there we go. Alright, so basically, we don't even have to catch this legendary, we're just get given a legendary for free. After we uh, dispatch these pesky Team Maga nonsense people. Team Maga, yes, Team team Manga. Yeah, they're very into Japanese art. <laughs> Alright, not only, basically, not only do we get um, a legendary, we get a Mega Evolving legendary and the ability to Mega Evolve. So it's just a great day. It's just like a very good day in the world of Pokemon when you get all these things for free. You don't have to catch anything, you don't have to do anything, just talk to Steven. Well, we do technically have to do something. We've got to do this um, this little fight. This, wow, a camera up and a coughing. Ugh, that is a bit nasty. But Steven's got his Metang. Of course, Steven's got his Metang. What else would he have? And yes, even though Doggy's level 5. He is, he is just scaring the hell out of these Pokemon by Intimidate. Alright, uh, so I'm going to switch on over to Bon. Alrighty, Bon, Bon is in, and what's everybody going to do? Zen Headbutt. Hit the coughing, hit the coughing. Nice one. You know how to play, Steven. That's right. Destroy those coughings, sir. Destroy them. And Doggy gets some XP, which is awesome. Six. Learn Ember. Not too shabby. But basically, once he learns something like Flamethrower or something... Flamethrower is a TM, but I have no idea where they get it. I'll probably look it up. Uh, but I will eventually use uh, the Fire Stones. And whoa, that was pain. Wow. Um, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and heal right quick. All right, Bonnie's being healed from that nonsense attack. And uh, I apologize if there was a noise in the background just then. I have no idea what that was. Uh, but what are you going to do? Earth Power again. This is scary. Oh my god. 
Um, now, do I risk it? Do I just surf? Because it's four times effective. Is it half health? Stop my blurry camera. Skip ahead till it's not being blurry. There we go. Alright, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Do I risk it for a biscuit? Do you know what? No. No, I don't risk it because Zen Headbutt will probably kill it. I'm just going to heal again. That lobster loves that milk. Another Zen Headbutt. Brilliant. So kill the I literally did nothing in that fight. Oh, no, no. Oh, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, why are you not attacking? Oh, oh, God. If I can... Oh, my God. I'm just going to fucking... I'm just going to kill it. Surf. Surf, 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 surf. Oh, bully punch. Right. Oh, I literally did nothing that fight. That was purely Steven. <laughs> Me and my little lobster just healed. Oh, that could have gone terrible. There was three chances there. If any of those had crit, I would have lost Bon and Jovi. And, oh, Older Sleeve? Sack that off with a can of spam. Yeah, if I had lost Bon and Jovi then, I would have cried. I really would have cried because I am very much looking forward to, um, do you know what? I have no idea what they evolve into. I know what they look like. It's like Durangle. That's what Skrelp evolves into. And... God, what the hell does Clone Tree evolve into? What's it called? I know what it looks like. It's like levitating off the ground. I can't remember. Chiser or something. I can't have a Z in its name. Oh, I don't know, bloody know. Anyway, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. So after that very embarrassing double battle where I did nothing except heal, we get given a legendary, a mega stone, and a mega ring because reasons of the plot. <laughs> Thank you very much, Stephen. Greatly appreciated. So there we are. Ladias is so impressed with our healing that he wants to come with us. <laughs> Cheers, Ladias. Ladias, Ladios. I'm just. Call I'm going to call him Lati. No, not Latino. That'd be racist. Um, I'm going to call him Lewis. No. I'm going to call him... I'm not going to call him anything. I'm going to give a nickname to Ladios. Uh, yes. Ladios is now called He With Name. <laughs> because he has a name. <laughs> I'm not going to use this Pokemon. However, however, it is... I'm technically going to use its ability, so to speak. You can um, essentially use Fly. You can soar around the world on it whenever you want. And it's, um, it's technically not using it. You don't have it on your team. And if like you can, I can trade this Pokemon away and still do the whole f soaring about, which is awesome. There's the Mega Bracelet, so if I'm lucky enough to get a pair with a Mega and find the Mega Stone, yeah, things are going to be awesome. Uh, I was going to get a Mega Beedrill. Hmm, never forget that first gym. Ugh. Anyway, so he's going to keep on talking about Mega Evolution. We don't care, Stephen. Well, we, we care a little bit, but it's just we already know these things. Alright, let's get the hell out of Dodge. Alrighty. So... What now? <laughs> what are we going to do? I just want to I just want to train up Doggy in style. I really do. <laughs> I want to use them properly. Two awesome fire types. But uh, obviously very rarely, if not, if never, have them on the... Have them on a team together. Unless you're doing like a full fire team. <laughs> hmm, a full fire team. How might that go? Um... My favourite, honestly, right, my favourite fire type is Melvin. Uh, Melvin uh, is the name I always give to Darumaka. I really love that Pokemon, but it's just dawned on me that I don't, I can't actually soar yet. I don't have that flute, or at least if I do, I can't find it. And also, uh, my Ladias has taken up the spot of uh, Doggy, my Growlithe, so I'm going to need to head back to the Pokemon Centre and sort this out, so I'll be back in a sec. And I'm back. Yeah, I was under the impression that as soon as you got your Ladias Ladios, you could fly on it. But I was unfortunately wrong. Um, yeah, I fought that Kecleon just then, and Style got to level uh, 9, which is awesome. Alrighty, right. I'm just going to quickly heal up uh, Joby, because he took some damage. Oh dear, what's all this about? <laughs> Hello sir, how are you today? <laughs> Didn't realise I was going to get into a fight then. And yeah, you're challenged by Bird Keeper Chester. And he's got a Swablu. Swablu's a nice Pokemon. Altaria. I, I think I mentioned, I definitely mentioned in the previous video, that I utterly adore Altaria. So that's, well, I say I adore Altaria, I actually really love um, its evolution, well, the Mega Evolution. I'm um, just going to switch over to Richie. Alright, uh, Richie is in. I'm actually a bit scared that some of these Pokemon might have, um, what's the word, pursuits, and that'll just wreck my day. <laughs> but hey, that's a risk I, I run with, uh, with this. Uh, so, 
Really? Faster? Uh, it is a massive shield face, so I suppose it can't move very fast. <laughs> Damage by recoil, it should just be dead from flying into that massive face. <laughs> anyway, it goes down like a light. Down like a light, yes, that is apparently the expression. Oh well. Style gets worse. Try a quick attack. Um, yeah, quick attack's not too shabby. I think I'll ditch. Um, mm, um, baby doll eyes. Yeah. I don't want no, want no pezzy little fairy type moves. For the quickle tickle. Style gets to 11. And the keeper's bringing out Swellow. Eyes ah, again. Oh, that is a good Pokemon. Alright, Style is in to get the XPs. Bring on the Swellow. He's a scary Pokemon. And Style, get the hell out of there. Alrighty, Richie, do your thing. Do your thing, Richie, do your thing. Seriously, there's very few things in this world that can kill a Richie. I mean, just look at that face. It's just the face of does not care. It's just like, I'm sorry. Did you just hit me? Because I think I felt a slight gust of wind. <laughs> oh, dear. Wow, that, but unfortunately, he sacrifices some quite, a lot of attack for... Um, uh, seriously, that was, that was a stab rock tomb, and it didn't kill some of the 13 levels lower. 13? What level was that swell? I was, no, 28, alright. I thought it said 20. <laughs> oh well, at least it goes down. Bye bye, Swellow. You awesome, awesome Pokemon. A Swellow with um, guts and facade uh, is awesome. <laughs> it really is. Just ditched uh, Raw for that Confuse Ray. Getting all of the XPs. Wow, that is a lot of XPs. Nice one, style. Oh, 14. Alright. So, we're probably going to fight a lot of those little bird keepers, which is, uh, I suppose, a thing. Um, Alright, let's so just switch up the team a smidge. Bring Doggy to the front to fight this lovely young lady. I'm really not reading this dialogue today, <laughs> like, at all. It's a, it's a lock. Why would I care about the dialogue? I've done this before. Ooh, a Cacnea. Eek, that is scary. Now, if only these uh, fire types were a decent level. Oh well. They usually got that intimidate off. Uh, switch on over to something. I'm bringing Jovi back. Yeah. Oh, he's ingraining. He ain't going nowhere. What's quite fun is that um, you can use ingrain, and then let's say you level up in the process, um, and you can forget ingrain by learning a move, but ingrain can still in effect. <laughs> it's quite funny. It happened in a Nate and Dookie video, and uh, yeah, it was quite funny. Alright, Jove gets experience, Doggy gets experience, gets the 13, and the mighty Yenna. Switch on over again to Doggy. Alrighty, Doggy is in, ready to intimidate the mighty Yenna. Probably good. It's going to, going to be a double intimidate, isn't it? Doggy's intimidate, are we going to get an imitate? No, we're not. Um, Alright, I'm going to switch on over to something big and scary like Richie. Alright, Richie, dispatch this dog, dispatch this dark dog with extreme prejudice, good sir. Oh, my special attack. No, not my special attack. <laughs> just that face is just like, I didn't know I had a special attack. <laughs> oh, well. Assurance. We, we are definitely now incredibly sure that we don't have a special attack. <laughs> we are so sure of it. Oh, this is going to take a few rock tombs. Oh, well. It's got to be done, unfortunately. Should probably have gone to uh, Richie, but, I mean, Eddie. Whatever the one is. I think it's Eddie. I remember because Eddie is like head. Eddie, because he's got a big head. Well, small head. He's all about the head. Oh dear. It's actually incredibly late at night right now, so I'm a bit tired, so please forgive my ramblings. Alright, Mighty Eddie will go down with this last rock tomb. And I believe there's a root over here, but I have no idea what number it is. Uh, but we, we shall find out after these messages. <laughs> after these XPs. Alright, level 14, awesome. 15, anything else? Not 16. Alright, Miley. Cheers, greatly appreciated. Alright, so let's go check this other route, shall we? And here we go. It is route 1, 2, 3. Oh, well, it's not even. So, yeah, with that, I will bid you adieu, and I will see you later. Bye! Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.